Hiya, Jessie here, back to tell you more about pet health. Uh, today we're going to focus on ear cleaning. Uh, there are a lot of infections that cats can get in their ears like ear mites, yeast infections, bacterial infections, and even food allergies. So today I'm going to show you how to make your own homemade ear cleaning solution and roughly how to use it. As well as that, I'm going to show you how to make a home remedy for things like bacterial or yeast infections or ear mites. So we'll get started. There's only two ingredients you need for each one. The first one would be a vinegar and water dilution. You can use either an apple cider vinegar like this one, or you can use uh, a white vinegar. Most people have white distilled vinegar in their homes um, for any reason. So basically you do five parts water to one part vinegar. You mix it and put it into a bowl, something like this. I like it because I can get my hand in this one easily. And you take a cotton ball, if you've got a small cat, you just pinch off a little piece. If you've got a large dog, you'd want to use the whole thing. So you dip the whole thing into the water solution and wring it out almost completely. You want to leave a little bit damp in there so that when you put it in the ear, it trickles down into the ear canal because you never want to put your fingers in there or any other objects like Q-tips. Um, so you just put it in there, squeeze the, the ear, fold the ear in half and rub it around. Let it sit for about uh, 10 seconds take the cotton swab out and then quickly get another one that's dry try to hold your pet's head still because it's going to have the instinct to shake and put the ear uh, put the cotton ball into the ear and hopefully that'll absorb all of the excess liquid that's trapped in there and then you can take something like your finger and a tissue or even a cotton bud or something like that and get all the little uh, nooks and crannies inside there clean out any infection that you might see any discoloration any wax any ear mites, anything that you can see in the ear, get it all cleaned out. Your dog or cat will have the instinct to still shake its head because I'm sure there'll be some water trapped inside the ear canal. That's fine. Take them outside, let them do that, bring them back in and swab out the rest of it and you should have a pretty clean ear. After you've done all that, we go on to our remedy for ear mites. Um, basically what I like to use is a carrier oil and tea tree oil. Tea tree is wonderful. This is by Atlantic Aromatics. Let me see if that'll focus. No, it's not going to, is it? Okay. Anyway, that's Atlantic Aromatics. They put out excellent medicinal grade um, essential oils. This one's fantastic. This is tea tree oil and this is avocado oil from the same company. Or you can even use any household oil like sunflower oil or grapeseed oil. Don't use canola or olive oil, they're too thick. Um, and what you do is you would take like a dilution bottle, something like this, fill it up almost all the way with your carrier oil, and then tip your tea tree oil into it. Do, for a 50 ml size this, you could probably do about 10 drops of tea tree oil. And get that in there, mix it up really, really well. And two options with that, you can either take this and since it already has uh, a dropper in it, you could drop five to six drops of this into the ear and then close the ear and hold the head and hopefully it'll drip down inside. And then you can even take a clean, dry cotton ball, put that inside the ear and hold it there for just a minute so it can get deep inside the canal and then start wiping all the excess out. Again, the animal will have ins its instinct to shake to get the excess oil out of the ear. That's totally fine. Let them go outside and do it again and then swab the rest of it out. Now, that's it. That's all you have to do. Um, if you want, you can also take the top off and you can just put the, um, the cotton ball right onto the oil, tip it over, put it inside the ear, and, and hold it for 10 to 20 seconds just to get the oil to go into the ear canal and kill all the mites. Now, tea tree oil kills everything on contact. It kills yeast, it kills bacteria, viruses, and it kills microbes, like mites and um, any other kind of parasite that might be um, on or in the animal. So that's my home remedy. That's my advice to you. If you have any questions, please contact me. Uh, visit my website at www.tailwaggers.ie. You can contact me by email, you can phone me, or you can stop by the shop in Kilcolgan. Thanks, and have a great night. Bye!